My name's Masa Saito. I'm a sophomore in college working part time at Koiwa Ramen Shop. Just got an order for Bowman. Oh, okay. Uh. Ugh. You're so useless. Move your butt and work faster. Uh, I'm sorry. This is Reina Maeda, our ramen shop manager. She used to be in a gang, really strict with us workers, but. Whoa, she's super cool today as well. Yep, she's someone I really look up to. Uh, hey, Masa. Great job today. Can you believe it? Reina went off on me again. <laughs> I guess it's not your day. Seriously, though? How do you manage to not give up when she's always yelling at you? To be honest, I've got a crush on Reina. Hold on. Are you for real? Even after all the yelling she gives you? That's what I love about her. Which is why I want to tell her how I feel once she recognizes my hard work. I'll give it my all until then. Huh? Oh, I see now. But man, she's a tough one to impress. I'm not backing down. Even after I graduate college, I'll still be here working part-time until that day comes. <sighs> You're too loud, Masa. Okay, okay, I got it. The next day, I need to work my butt off to get Reina to acknowledge me. Here you go. Thanks for being patient. Uh, this isn't what I ordered. Uh, oops, I'm sorry about that. I'll go get the right one real quick. Uh huh? Aw, oh, man, I messed up in front of Reina again. I was constantly messing things up all day, and... Hey, can I talk to you for a sec? S sure thing. Uh-oh, here comes the scolding. Um, you've been working hard lately, huh? Wait, what? I've only been messing things up, though. Why is she... <laughs> Could it be? Um, Reina, you didn't happen to hear me talking yesterday, did you? Huh? Well, what are you talking about? No way, she actually overheard me? Uh, but then why is she... Oh, could it be? I totally understand how you feel, Reina. W what does that mean? You were just giving me compliments on my work so I could gear up for job searching, right? How in the world did you reach that conclusion? Oh, I got it wrong? Then why... Forget it. You're right. I'm just worried about your future. I knew it. Thanks for watching out for me, Reyna. But honestly, I want to step up and be a solid, dependable worker who can truly support you here instead of searching for a job. Uh, well, if you're really set on it, then I guess I'll have to go along with it. I'll make sure you improve and get better at your work, as your boss. And so, Reyna began teaching me even harder while working at the ramen shop, and... A few days later... I'm really sorry for dragging you along to help with getting the ingredients. What are you talking about? I'd do whatever you need, Reyna! Uh, right... But I had no idea you were so specific about the ingredients in our ramen for customers. For the shop to thrive, we have to be specific about what we use. Um, I'm curious. How do you handle working so hard at the ramen shop? I inherited that ramen shop from an older friend who helped me out in the past. From an older friend? Yeah. We used to work together. But when she got sick, I started managing the ramen shop. How's she doing these days? Yeah, she's doing much better. She swings by the ramen shop sometimes, even though your schedules don't always match up. But sales have been down at the ramen shop recently. We used to be so popular back in the day, and we even got interviewed on TV. Could it be that you've been strict with us because... Yeah, I'm sorry about that. I've been so caught up in managing the shop that I may have been too strict with the staff. I just wanted everyone to be dedicated to their work. Oh, I get it now. A actually, I didn't 
believe you were serious about the job. Because you were constantly grinning and laughing in the kitchen. My bad. No way! I was just trying to be friendly with the customers and keeping a smile on my face, you know? Since customer service is key here. You don't have to keep smiling in the kitchen, though. Wait, for real? Well, that explains why I was the only one smiling. Anyways, I want to have a better relationship with everyone else, just like my older friend did. Don't worry, you'll be fine, Reyna. Huh? Everyone knows how much you care about this ramen shop. Plus, your older friend knew you could handle this ramen shop. So you don't have to try to be like her, just be yourself. Uh, th thanks, Masa. And, um, you know, you're already doing great just the way you are. Huh? Uh, wait, Reyna, does that mean... Whoa, you're so nice for carrying the shopping bags. <laughs> but they're actually in my other hand, not this one. <sighs> What's up with the heavy sigh? Oh, just forget it. Come on, we're going back to the shop. Hey, wait up. Whoa, whoa that totally caught me off guard. I almost got her wrong for a moment. I mean, no way, right? Wait, isn't she... A few days later, getting better at the job became easier with Reyna's training, and... I'll serve the cooked ramen to the customers. Can you clean and clear the tables that are empty? Got it! Uh... Hey, can you do me a favor real quick? Of course, what do you need? Can we take a photo together? I want to post it on Tokista. Sure thing! Thanks a bunch! Uh. Ten minutes later. Thanks for the great ramen! Alright, well, see ya! Wow, she was such a lively customer. Huh? Wait, wasn't that... Masa! What's with the zoning out? Let's go, time to get back to work! S sorry And I know you were just snapping a photo with her, but weren't you both getting a bit cozy? Huh? You think so? I mean, she was adorable, right? I bet you were so happy. Wait, Reyna, are you... No, that's not... Oh, relax. No need to stress. I'm positive you'll also connect better with our customers. Forget it. Just get back to work. Despite all that, I got more into my part-time job and... Things have been going great for me lately. I'm hoping Reyna will start to see all the effort I've been making. Vasa, we got a situation, come quick! Huh? Whoa, why is there such a big line? What's going on? Wait, you didn't know? The girl you snapped a photo with is Ron Tenshin, a really popular Tokituber. That's why her fans are all here at the shop. Wait, seriously? I mean, we gotta hurry up and make more ramen for these customers ASAP! R right But it was our first time handling a large crowd of customers. The kitchen was total chaos. Oh no, what should we do? We're running out of ingredients. Alright, I'll go get more ingredients. You guys keep things under control. Got it! I need to stay calm and give it my all right now. That's what I thought, but... Hey, is it my turn yet? Please be patient for just a bit more. <laughs> Ron Tenshin actually recommended this ramen joint. It's really awful and lame. I'm terribly sorry. Excuse me, waiter. Y yes Man, I'm still not good enough. Hey all, I'm back now. Sorry for the holdup. Reyna! All right, let's get to work. With Raina back, the shop quickly got back on track and... Thank, thank you, you very, very much. much! Hey, Masa, good work today. Raina, I'm really sorry. What's the apology for? I made the customers wait, which must have made them feel pretty irritated and uncomfortable. 
You're incredible, Reyna. I'm just not up to par. <gasps> That's not true. You did great, Masa. Dealing with all those customers while smiling the whole time was really impressive. I'm not as friendly as you, so I find it pretty cool. Reyna. Hey, don't you think Reyna is, like, actually a really kind person? You're only figuring that out now? Reyna recognized my effort. I'll really step it up to be more supportive next time. And soon enough, I got another opportunity to prove myself. A few days later... Hey everyone, do you have a sec? So we're gonna have a TV crew swing by and film the shop. No way! Are you serious? Yep. Ron Tenshin recommended our shop on our social media, right? And that caught the attention of some TV folks. They want to feature our shop. Wow, but this is our shot. Let's really work hard to let more people know about this place. Yeah! So we all started working even harder, but... Uh... Reyna, oh, what's wrong? One of the part-time employees unexpectedly wanted to leave. Oh no, why? He didn't really want to explain why he needed to leave all of a sudden. Maybe he's just had enough of me being so strict. No way. This has always been my situation. I never really clicked with people, and I ended up leaving high school. The same thing happened with my other part-time jobs. I was hoping things would change this time around, but maybe I'm just not the right fit for being a shop manager. Reyna, even if everyone else quits, I won't. Huh? Besides, the staff aren't as fragile as you thought. They're still sticking around, so you can have more faith in them. Why are you always so sweet? You probably can't stand troublemakers like me, right? That's not true! Huh? Yeah, there was a time where I had a tough time dealing with troublemakers. But that was before I met you, Reyna. You know, back then you helped me out when some troublemakers were bothering me. I helped you out? You were so awesome and cool when you lent a hand back then. And when I heard about Koiwa Ramen, I just had to apply. So there's absolutely no way I could hate you. You're such a weirdo. You know that? <laughs> I get that a lot. But thanks. After that, Reyna started looking out for the other staff members. Soon after, the part-time worker who had been on leave came back. It turns out his parents got sick and he didn't want to cause any trouble at our workplace by mentioning it. So he kept it to himself. Now that they're feeling better, we're all working together to keep the shop running smoothly. And finally, the day came for filming the shop. So, I heard you're the person who took over this ramen shop. Yes, the previous owner was a wonderful mentor to me. Oh my gosh! Seeing Otakuda, the amazing announcer in real life, is just mind-blowing! Otaku the announcer? Who's that? Don't you know anything at all? And his name's not Otaku, it's Otakuda. What the? Your shop isn't open today? Sorry, we're closed for a private event today. Wait, why are you here? Isn't he the customer who was here the other day? You're asking why? Huh? Do I actually need an excuse to go to a ramen joint? I mean, having fun is your main priority while you handle things here, isn't it? What? That's not... Are you really sure you can say that? I saw you flirting with one of your staff members while you were shopping for ingredients the other day. <laughs> wow, you're still the same as you were in high school. <laughs> you dropped out of school, quit other jobs quickly, and now you want to be on TV. Just quit working at this shop already. Everyone's scared of you anyway. <laughs> That's... Quit talking crap! What did you just say? I'm not afraid of Reyna. Yeah, she can be strict, but it's only because she loves this place. She's actually really nice and sweet. What? <laughs> so what? 
she's not the kind of person who would back down easily. And if anyone messes with her, they'll have to deal with me. <laughs> who the hell do you think you are? Hold up, weren't you the one she was flirting with? <laughs> F fine, I'll go for now. Must be nice showing off in front of the girl you have a crush on. Oh well, this ramen shop's reputation is totally wrecked now. Can we chat for a sec? Huh? Wait, isn't that woman? Uh, nope, now's not the time. I'm really sorry for the disruption. Can we carry on with the shoot? Um, are we good with this? If we air it and something goes south... Yeah... If this shop is always filled with customers like him... You understand where I'm coming from, right? Yeah, it is a shame, but we should scrap the shoot. No way! Please, wait! Um... Please, can we continue with filming here? Our manager put in a lot of effort to pull this off. You guys? So, we just really want to show everyone how great this ramen shop is. Please. Hmm, but... Come on, it's all good. Let's do this. Let's continue with the filming. I'll talk you to, but... Before I became an announcer, I worked in the restaurant industry, too. Even the most popular spots can have customers who are a handful like him. And... Given how much her staff loves her, everything should be fine. I'll take the blame if anything goes sideways. All right, then. Let's carry on with the filming. Thank, Thank you, you so much. much! And so, the interview and filming kept going without a hitch. Hey, everyone. I'm really sorry for the hassle. That guy always tried to start fights with me when I was a troublemaker. Thanks so much for all your help today. The interview and shoot went smoothly thanks to all of you. Not at all. You worked so hard for this, Reina. We didn't do much. But I'm glad the interview and shoot were a total success. I was really strict with you guys. So why did you stick up for me? Yeah, you seemed a little intimidating in the beginning. But just in the beginning. I mean, you're just a girl in love, Reina. Once we got to know that part of you, you didn't seem scary anymore. Let's have a chat about love next time. Just as girls, Reina. Um... Oh, do you have feelings for someone, Reina? Uh... Why the weird looks, guys? <clears throat> anyway, I'm sorry for being too tough on you all. And I'm really looking forward to keep working together. Of course, we'll be sticking around. Good luck with your love life, Reina. Thanks for today. Thanks a bunch for today, Masa. Not at all. I didn't do much. You told me to have faith in everyone, and you were right. You helped me change, and I'm really grateful. I thought I'd be the one guiding you, but turns out I was the one learning. Reina... So, um, don't you have anything to say? Um, oh, right. Thank you so much for everything, Reina. Now I can put all my energy into finding a job. No, that's not what I meant. <gasps> I love you, Reina. I feel like I can give it my all when I'm with you. So please go out with me. You finally confessed your feelings, huh? Huh? I've always loved you, too. Always? I was strict and intimidated, everyone. But you were never intimidated by me, Masa. You know, I overheard you talking about how much you respected how hard I worked for the shop. And that's when I realized I liked you. That's why I couldn't stand seeing you smiling and laughing all the time at work. But that's how much I cared about you. Reina! I love how real and upfront you always are, Masa. Me too. I love you too, Reina. Since then, thanks to the TV interview, Koiwa Ramen became even more popular. Otakura and Ron are now regulars of the ramen shop too. 
That troublemaker? Well, it seems he actually admired Reyna. He missed her when she stopped being a troublemaker and wanted to hang out with her as fellow troublemakers. That day, Reyna's older friend caught him and gave him a talking to. Later, he came back to apologize and promised not to cause any more trouble. And Reyna and I kept dating after that, and... A few years later, here's your bowl of Koiwa ramen! Thanks, Masa. You've grown into a solid and dependable worker. Thank you! It's great to see you're doing good. You're pretty much a regular around here. So, when are you two tying the knot? Say what? I know you too well, Masa. You'll probably keep putting off proposing by saying you need to mature more or something. That's not true at all! I know this isn't the right place, but Reyna, will you marry me? <gasps> yes, I will! I love you, Masa! <laughs> Aw, congrats, you two. May your lives be filled with happiness forever. Hi, it's me, Camille. Thanks for watching my channel. I'm super happy if you watch the next and other videos too.